Hello, my lovelies. Welcome back to my channel, Reba Fitness. Reba here today, and today I'm going to be doing a short 10 minute yoga session for you guys. I like to do short bursts of yoga just so that I can try to get a little yoga in every day as opposed to stressing myself out and saying I'm going to do an hour of yoga, an hour of stretching. It just stresses me out thinking how am I going to find the time to do it. And I think if you can just get 10 minutes of yoga or stretching in a day, it's going to be so beneficial to you. And so today I'm going to do um, a 10 minute yoga session that I usually do in the mornings when I get up out of bed, get my coffee going and um, I come in here and I'll do some stretching to get the day started and along with that I'll end with some deep breathing and some meditation and just try to focus on um, what I'm grateful for and my intentions for the day and I'll try to usually pick one word to focus on while I'm meditating and doing my deep breathing and that helps reinforce that thought process in my mind for the day. All right, so we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna get started. We're gonna lie down, um, but before we get started, I just wanna remind you guys, if you're not already subscribed to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. Once you do, you'll see a little bell icon that pops up, and if you click on that bell icon, you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video. And be sure to check out all of my exclusive content on my other platforms and the links for that will be in the description below and also for the month of February I'll be doing a lot more exclusive content um, on my other uh, sites but also on my Fit Nice channel I'll be doing a lot more lingerie try on hauls as well so be sure to check out my other uh, YouTube channel Fit Nice, which is also in the description below. All right, so let's get started, shall we? All right, so let's just go ahead. We're going to start by lying on our backs. And we're just going to bring those knees into the chest. This is a great exercise to do first thing in the morning to kind of just wake everything up. Take some nice big deep breaths here. And you can just kind of like pump those knees in and out. Whatever feels good to you. You can grab those knees, spread them apart. Grab your feet here. And just kind of rock back and forth. Bring those feet down to the mat or the floor, whatever you have. We're going to take that left leg up and bring the ankle into the knee. And we're going to pull behind that right leg and stretch here. Again, take some nice big deep breaths here. Go ahead and take that leg down, take that left leg up, and point the toes, and then flex, and then just do that a couple times, point and flex, point and flex, point and flex, and then go ahead and bring that leg down, and we're just going to come up into a bridge and squeeze the booty, and release, again, Squeeze the booty and release. All right, so let's go ahead. Let's do the other side. So now we're going to take that right ankle to the left knee. We're just going to come forward. Deep breath here. Mm. Take that right leg up, point those toes, and flex. 
point and pass, point and pass, point and pass. Good, bend the knee, bring both feet down to the mat, lift the booty up and squeeze and release. Again, up, squeeze and release. All right, so we're just gonna roll to the side here. We're gonna come up. We're gonna just cross one leg in front of the other, like this. All right, so we have one leg in front of the other and we're just slowly gonna walk those hands out. And slowly walk them in. Go ahead and take your left hand to that right knee Look over that right shoulder. And then come on back. Now take the other leg, place it in front of the other one. And again, sit up nice and tall, walk those hands out. Notice one side's a little bit tighter than the other, and that's perfectly fine. And slowly walk those hands back in. Now let's go ahead and stretch the other side. So place the right hand to that left knee, look over that left shoulder. We're going to come into our tabletop position here. So we're on our hands and knees, and we're just going to bring those hands just a few inches above where the shoulders are. We're going to do a hover here where we're just going to hover those knees up off the mat. All right, and then back down. All right, we're going to do that again. So we're going to come back up into a hover. And then we're going to straighten those knees and come into a plank. All right, come back to your hover. And then up into a downward dog. And so we're going to just go through that sequence a couple more times. So we're here in our hover, plank, hover, hover those knees, downward dog. All right, let's do that one more time. So we're hovering our knees into a plank, back to a hover, and downward dog. Good, stretch it out here. Go ahead and pedal those knees if you need to. So while we're in downward dog, take that left leg up, stretch it out behind you as much as you can, bring it forward into a lunge. <clears throat> Go ahead and place that left hand down, twist, take that right arm up, and back down. And we're just gonna come up into a runner's lunge here. Bring those hands to the heart. And then come up. Go ahead and place your weight on that left leg. You're gonna wrap that right leg in front of the left leg. And then just come down, find your focus. And then come down a little bit more and then rise up. Take those hands behind you, back bend, shoulders back. Take those arms overhead. And 
release those arms down. Leg go way out. And then come back to a flat back and slowly come on up. <clears throat> We're going to come down to our downward dog again. This time we're gonna take that right leg up. And we're gonna do everything on the other side. Open that right leg up as high as you can. Bring it forward. <clears throat> and do a twist on the other side. Back down. Come into your runner's lunge. Bring your hands to your heart. And up we go. Go ahead and wrap that left leg now onto that right leg. And come down. Hands to heart and focus. Again, arms behind you, cross those fingers, back bend, take those arms up. And leg dog here. Just relax. Come up to a flat back, hands to shins, bend those knees, come up nice and slow. Stretch to one side and stretch to the other side. Reach up. And relax. So then I just like to come down. <clears throat> into my cross-legged position. I don't like to do Shavasana in the morning because I find that it relaxes me too much and it makes me want to go back to sleep. So I just usually come back into my folded leg position, roll the shoulders back a little bit if I'm still feeling tense there, but take this time to breathe in Again, this is a great time for meditation, for gratitudes, to really think about what you're grateful for. There's so much to be grateful for, and uh, it just helps you be so much more positive and productive when you can focus on the things that you're grateful for. And then <clears throat> try to be mindful of the day. Have one word in mind for your intention. And then as you're deep breathing and meditating, focus on that word and then focus on that word throughout the day. So again, we're going to take one more deep breath in. And exhale. Again, my lovelies, please check out the links to my other platforms and my other YouTube channel. They're all in the description below. And until next time. Peace out. Namaste.